it's an incredible thing. I mean, feeling as I do about this man and his legacy and his music, having the opportunity to make this film with his family. We shot quite a bit of it here in the UK and even visited places that Bob was here in the UK, Battersea Park and Oakley Street. It's incredible. And obviously we got our incredible Bob and Rita and they did such an incredible job and so many incredible UK actors uh, in our cast. Um, so it's incredible, incredible. Well, I think, I think there's something uh, about this story where it was in London that he reported Exodus, uh, which is one of his landmark records. And I feel like this is a period in this film of, of almost like an exile. Exodus is a story of exile and Bob's whole life was about these transitions and this is one of the crucial ones and as Ziggy was saying it's like this is in a way one of the most formative periods of his life so the fact that it happened in the UK and and you know the the community that he can uh, speak to here is obviously a, a big part of you know what we hope the film will will ignite I mean his catalog is almost Su supernatural in nature. Um, I have my favorites. Um, you know, there's probably like a 10-way tie, tie for first or something, or a 50-way tie for first. But I love, you know, I, I I love I love the songs in, in the movie. Um, songs like War and um, Redemption Song, obviously, but also some of the deeper cuts like So Just Say and um, Talking Blues and um, even some of the early Studio One stuff. I'm, 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 I'm gonna nerd out here, so you, you want you want to shut me up, probably. He was a deeply spiritual person, person of great um, kind of clarity about what was important to him in life. He seemed to be somebody that had like a transcendent uh, message that everything was intentional in, in the service of that. And um, I think that's why the music hits so hard um, because it was animated by something really not normal, which is a, a deeply spiritual purpose. And uh, he seemed to be, from you know what I can understand, somebody that really um, made the most of a very sadly short time.